Our next guest became a household name when she was still in her teens. Jamie Lynn, C Jamie Lynn Sigler starred as Meadow for six seasons on the award-winning series The Sopranos. And after almost 25 years after the premiere, she's still working with her on-screen brother, Robert Eiler. They do a podcast together. It's called Not Today, Pal. Not Today. <laughs> uh, and Jamie is here this morning to tell us a little bit more about the podcast and also to share an important message as well. Always good, good to have morning. you. Thank you. So Welcome good to back. be back. Yes. Thank you. I You're always love coming. Busy these days. Mom, wife, actress, podcaster now. Very full life. Yes, I wouldn't have it any other way. Tell us about the podcast because this, I mean, for folks who don't know, you do the podcast with your, your on-screen brother from 25 years mm -hmm. ago. Mm -hmm. You guys still have this, like, magic. But tell folks about the podcast. Sure. Uh, yeah, Robert and I have worked together and been best friends for over 20 years. We had a very unique experience together we know each other we've seen each other through a lot of life mm -hmm. and we're also very different um a lot of our podcast is him making me very uncomfortable and watching <laughs> me react to that which is not far off from real life and it's just a nice it's a nice opportunity for people to see other sides of us get to know us a little bit more and it's just it's just silly and fun we're there to make people laugh and just have a brief 30 minutes of forgetting about your problems. Okay, so on that note, we found some uh, things you guys talked about that grabbed our attention. This one in particular, you said that um, you'd rather give birth than go to the dentist. That's Ooh. correct. And that you sleep at a temperature of 67 degrees yes. every night. Oh. Not by choice, but that's my husband's choice. Well, that's Craig. He likes, you like it hot around here. Our like cool around here. Cold. Yeah, but I also live in Austin now, uh, which is we've had over 100 degree temperatures for over three mm -hmm. months, so 67 <laughs> is lovely. And you'd rather give birth than go to the dentist? I had lovely births. I don't know. I really don't enjoy the dentist. It's just everyone, I guess, has something, and that is the place the I just thing. do not want to At go least to. with birth, there's like something to help you along a little bit. At the dentist, it's you just like You get something at just, the end, yeah. yeah dentist, true. sometimes, you know, you're, yeah. So yeah. You don't get to go home with anything exactly. fun and cute. Uh, we, we have had a sleep expert on that said 67 degrees is the ideal temperature oh, for, well, for best well, sleep. There we go. Um, it, it's seven years ago on the Today Show, you revealed that you suffered from RMS. Yes. And I thought it was interesting because I read that you said if someone asks you, how are you doing? Yeah. It used to be triggering for yeah, you. Not, not anymore, but it used to be. Why is that? Well, I think it used to trigger me because I kept my RMS a secret. Mm. And so... I really wanted to be able to say how I was, but couldn't. And I also didn't know if I was ready. And so when you talk about being here seven years ago, I think it was a lot about me seeing how the world would accept me now that they knew that I live with multiple sclerosis. But now I'm here today yeah. where I accept me with this, which has been quite a journey of self-reflection. I think we all have things that can, you know, challenge us, sure. but I think can also be a catalyst for mm -hmm. great growth. Mm -hmm. And so I'm so proud of where I'm at today. And I've collaborated with Novartis on this mm -hmm. project where we develop this three-step guide where we talk about reflecting, reframing, and reaching out. Because mm -hmm. with all of my experience, and despite me being able to sit here today, I am no different than anybody that's living with MS. Yeah. And I really feel like I have things to share and tools and things that I've found that have really helped me. And so if this calls to anybody, you can go to reframingms.com for more information. Mm -hmm. But really, the reframing and understanding that you can pivot in your life and you can still do things, mm -hmm. they may not look the same or be the same. Mm -hmm. For instance, I'm a baseball mom, so I get a <laughs> wagon that I can push where I can walk the long distance. Mm -hmm. Or if I'm going out with girlfriends, they'll drop me off at a restaurant and go they find go parking. Park. Mm -hmm. You know, it, I, I still want to fully participate yeah. in my life yeah. and I found ways to do yeah. that. I love that. We should mention you are a paid spokesperson for that pharmaceutical yeah. company, Novartis. And for folks who want to find out a little bit more about this, this three-step program to reframe the way they look at RMS, what's that. the website again? ReframingMS.com. I love Reframing that. ReframingMS.com. Thank you. I love Thank that. You so much. So good to see you. We do. Wait, wait, wait. I just have one more thing. Oh. Okay. Because I know there's somebody very special oh to you. Oh, my gosh. Your grandmother yes. is 102 years old. Oh. Whoa. Okay. And my mom, okay, her oh. name is Amelia Lopez. She lives in Manhattan all by herself. She's from Cuba, and my mom has submitted her to be a Smucker's <laughs> birthday like every year, oh, and she never goodness. got on. So this is so huge. Well, this is so amazing. Makes we, me want to cry. I want to spin around a Smucker's jar for her right now. Oh, oh, my God. She's 102 years Yay. old. Yay. She's the best. Nima, we call her. I love oh, you. Te quiero mucho. What a light. I love it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Wait, take a picture of the jar here. We got to <laughs> we'll, save we'll, we'll, we'll get you a picture of it. We'll get you a picture. Oh, my God. My mom's going to post that on Facebook. And <laughs> 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 oh, 
Excellent. Oh. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you so much. The podcast, Not Today, Pal. That podcast is out right now. We'll see Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.